Emacs Compressor is excited to announce the launching of its diesel-powered rotary screw air compressor. Here's Matt Kane to tell you a little bit more about the unit. Hi, this is Matt Kane here with the Emacs Compressor. The unit has mobility where they, this can be lifted with a crane, uh, loaded onto a trailer, a truck, or moved anywhere. Uh, this is um, center point balanced, so it's balanced to the unit, and you can lift the entire unit off of this hook. We're now going to talk about our weatherproof enclosure made to reduce the noise of the compressor as it's running. Uh, if you'll notice, this is a metal enclosure, so it's durable. The entire canopy is power coated, and it also has galvanized front and rear panels, and that's hot dipped galvanized, so it's made not to rust and prevents rust. And then also, we use a composite fender, so our fenders are composite, so they do not rust at all. Behind this wheel, you're going to see our torsion axle. Torsion axles eliminate the need for leaf springs. They give a good soft ride for the unit when you're towing it. Um, these are galvanized, so the unit will be out in harsh weather and you don't have to worry about the actual actually rusting or anything like that. All right, well now we're going to talk about our unique uh, adjustable hitch height because we know trucks, cars have uh, higher, medium to low hitches. So this hitch style allows you to loosen this and adjust your hitch from a height to medium to a low hitch height. And after you get it into position, you lock it and you're ready to go. One of the key features to this hitch is we can go from a two inch ball hitch or we can take it off here and actually put a panel hitch. So you have two options. You can run a ball hitch or you can run a panel, panel hitch application. The taillights, turn signals, and clearance lights are LED and DOT certified. Our compressor tires um, are our steel belted radials. Um, they're DOT certified. They do have a DOT certification number on the tire and they're uh, Tough tires make for tough, tough use. This is our control panel to our unit. And this is our key switch. If we turn this on, you'll notice this red light comes on at your ignition. Turn a little farther, that's your glow plugs for cold weather starting. This is your hour meter. This is your pressure gauge that's liquid filled. Um, this is your dual ball valve um, connection with Chicago fittings, so it's easy to attach your hose. Hi, our units are NATM certified, which means it's a National Association of Trailer Manufacturers that has to meet DOT certification. Our units come with a working title that you can take to the License Bureau. You can get tags. Some states require tags, some don't, but you do have that. It has a registration, comes with this unit. You'll see here we have the Kubota engine. Uh, that's an industrial engine that is tier four final, which means it meets California emissions and all US emissions, but California's your toughest. Um, these motors uh, have service centers everywhere and also adequate parts, easy to get parts for, and Kubota is one of the top brands today. This is our German made Rotocomp rotary screw air in. This is a twin screw. It's got twin rotors. Uh, this unit meets top quality specifications, uh, best in its class, performance, and durability. This is our unit fuel tank. Uh, this fuel tank is composite, so it's durable. Uh, it won't crack, won't rust. Uh, and also, it's see-through, so you can actually see the fuel level uh, and this is a large tank, it's 11 gallons, so we can get eight hours of runtime out of this unit with this fuel tank. All filters in our unit are equipped with MAN, German-made uh, filtration from the air filter to the oil filters. This is our variable speed control on the throttle of the engine. So basically, as you're letting air out of the compressor, this is going to 
work off your exact demand of air that's being used. So basically this will change the RPM of the engine as much as 1200 RPMs from full throttle to low throttle or anywhere in between depending on the demand that's being used. Wow, those are some really cool features. And I also want to mention that the Air End comes with an optional 10 year warranty. So what's that mean to the end user? Well, regardless of the hours, if the Air End fails, Emacs will just ship you a new Air End.